Yo up guys, Mr. Gross here, back from MBR Starcast. Today I'm going to be doing a new series on WoW. Quite a few of you guys have been asking if I can do a new Let's Play on a new champion and make a champion from the start. In the past, you know, I've been doing the videos of my MBR Troll, which is level 90, um, and my Warlock, uh, who I really enjoy. I think it's pretty cool. I've got this new character, so I may still do some dungeons with them, but I like to work off the feedback from you guys. Um, I always think that the fans are the most important part of YouTube. If it wasn't for you guys, you know, I wouldn't be making videos. So I want to try and please all you guys and make you happy. So I look at your comments as most, like the most. Uh, I don't always read all the comments, but I try to look at most of them and sort of take the feedback from there to make new videos and so forth. So if any guys still want to see some of my Warlock gameplay, I think it's really cool looking. It's my favorite character. I actually have, um, and then I've just got my druid. He doesn't look as cool, but I use Moonkin form a lot, which kind of makes, you know, it doesn't really bother me how he looks like here. But here's my level 90. Um, I have a death 90, he's only like one level, well, he starts at level 55. But I had a rogue, uh, Bob the Snake. I've got this priest, didn't really do anything, I'm just trying him out. Uh, my hunter, my hunter, just again trying him out. And I have a monk here, um, which was a tank monk, but I'm going to create a new monk for the start because. I've kind of got about two months experience on WoW and I have my gaming knowledge in general so I kind of understand the game a lot more than before so it's not really a noob edition as much, as much. it's not necessarily a professional edition but you know I have a general understanding of the game and if you guys only have any problems and you're new to WoW then I, I try and share my knowledge what I know but if you've been playing WoW for a while then I'm sure you know a lot more than me so a lot of you guys have been asking if I can do a monk um, I think personally the the pandas are like the coolest kind of monks. You know, it's what they're kind of set out for. I think the but the pandas look a cool class anyway. Um, so we're gonna give it a go. I'm probably gonna go healer spec to start off with, and then get damage spec. I didn't really enjoy the tank spec, or I did enjoy the early game tank spec. It was actually one of my first characters. I made this monk after I had level 36 druid on a different server, and then I made the monk thinking like, yeah, yeah, sick, and I didn't really get on with tanking too well, as I was new to the game, and then I went back to the druid, and obviously I made him level 90 now. Uh, I've got Tadron and all that on my, um, on my Warlock, so I can make like 16 slot bags, I almost make 20 slot bags, but I haven't really been playing a lot of WoW, obviously GTA's coming out, I've been playing quite a lot of uh, that, and obviously League as well, so I haven't really been playing too much WoW, but um, a couple of you guys have actually been asking if I can continue to make some videos, so I'm going to make a couple of these and see how they go, and if you guys enjoy them, then I'll continue on with this series and we can take it from there. Um, we'll see what happens, we give my dude a nice beard, I think. That one looks pretty cool. Quite like that. Oh, that, that's pretty nice actually. We've got to come up with a name. Um, I'm taking up MBR, which would be my main name. I'm pretty sure Mr. Big Russ is going to be taken, unfortunately. Um, don't know who took that, little bitches. Um, I don't know what to go for. The name's always the tricky part of the character, I always feel. Like, do we want to go for. Uh, MBR monk, I don't know, MBR just is what I always kind of use. Um, or we could go for. I really don't know, I always struggle, always, always, always struggle with um, names on games. It doesn't really matter too much, I guess, what the actual name is. Um, let's go have a look at Mr. Chi. Chi. Let's see if that comes up. Okay, name is unveilable. How the hell has someone got Mr. Chi Chi? I think that's quite a unique name, Mr. Chi Chi Chi. Let's try that. Surely not. I don't think I can add any more cheese to the end of this. Oh, that kind of sucks. Um. Hmm. What about MBR Chi Chi Chi? No, I don't really like the sound of that. God, I like I say, I suck with names. I don't have any imagination whatsoever. <laughs> it is my one downfall on the. Uh, well, especially stuff like WoW. Well, generally, a lot of games you don't really need a name, you can just have your standard name, but. I've kind of taken everything I want. Um, uh, what do I want? Something r random, maybe like Max. I have Bob the Snake, so maybe Max the Monk or Max the Panda. Max the Monk, just because it has double M in Let's have a look. Max the Monk, I'm pretty sure I spelt Monk right. I feel like an idiot if I spelt it wrong. 
have feeling on foot, right? My spam's not the greatest, so. There we go. Max the monk. It's taking me here, so. I have Max the panda, that's probably where I got Max from. Max the monk, there we go. So I wouldn't have actually had Max the panda. Max the monk, anyway. Let's step into his world. What I'm going to do is I've got these cool items here. One of those, and I think my legs or something give me 10% experience, so basically. I'm actually saying that I could switch them over right now. Well, I, I'd do the opening stage of this and make a short little intro video and continue through with this and then I'll switch over the items onto this guy, send them over just so that I can get better, quicker experience. It just makes it a lot easier for me questing. Um, it doesn't, you know, I'll still be able to show you guys what you need to do. It doesn't really change anything, just the fact that I level up a bit quicker compared to what you normally do. But that's just the benefit of like having a level 90 that you can kind of fund to be able to do stuff like that and what else you're really going to spend your money on. Train on the air, so here we go. I quite like the uh, Pandaria area. I've done a bit of it, like I say, I had that monk in the past, and I've done the hunter, and I think I might have done a no one somewhere. But got 10 XP on my on my level 90 uh, on my um, druid. Last time I can remember getting XP was like 270,000 per quest. <laughs> bit of a difference from that old 10, um, or was it 10? I don't know how much it was. Maybe it was. I can't remember. Um, anyway, what am I doing? Loot and equipped. I haven't actually equipped at that hat. There we go, we got to get returned. We're getting a bit uh, carried away in the old quest and we got to go kill these things in a second. Um, also what I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to probably go healer and get damage back. I'm not really interested in tank. I'm going to go healer straight away just so, because my items I have, uh, the sort of trinks or whatever they are, are for... Um, for uh, stamina, no, for spirit and like intellect and stuff. So, have being a healer, it helps that out a bit more. Even though I still use them if I was going uh, damage, just purely for the sake of the um, ten the additional XP. But being a healer would be nice because it should help me get in dungeons a bit quicker, um, especially at low level. It's not easy getting into dungeons at this kind of level. Anyway, uh, let's have a look. What does this actually use? My one uses just uh, energy. That's cool. I've got some chi. I think this is called chi. Maybe that's why I got the name chi from. Um, but yeah, that's probably why everyone took that name. Anyway, we don't have any special powers just at the moment, so we're just going to try and search through these quests as quick as possible. Oh, go kill the trainees. This is a little bit of a long part. They take a little while to get kill. The thing what annoyed me, what kind of put me off the tank on, uh, was the tank of the the monk tank is the fact that they use leather. They don't use mail. Like why? What kind of tank doesn't use mail or uh, or um? Like a plate, I think it was plate. I'm not sure. I said I don't. I've never really played a tank to late level. The only tank I played was my monk, and that was up to level 22. So, really didn't get anywhere far with it. Um. Anyway, we'll slowly get in it. Oh, didn't want that dude to attack me. Let's hope to regen up some HP first. But we'll see. He had different ideas. That's a pretty cool move that we put them to sleep. Obviously, I think if we attack them, it uh, wakes them up, unfortunately. Alright, we just want to regen some HP. Here we go, that should be enough. This is long. This was quite nice. I remember when I did this originally with a hunter. You should have your pet attacked in them. I'm pretty sure you have a pet this level. I could be wrong. I have a feeling you do. This dude, Billboy Jenkins, seems to be helping me out. 
Well, maybe not anymore. He was. I don't know if this is a real person or not. Uh, where is it? Does it say I can't see him? Anyway. It's not the end of the world. Um. What's going on then? We how many are we actually down? We need one more. This this dude to do. So I hope that dude's not attacking me as well. That kind of I think he is. You know, he's only yellow. I have a feeling he's just attacking me. No bitch. Go away. Leave me alone. Run away. I don't want to fight you, but I will kill you if you come anywhere near me. What the fuck is this dude? Who is this guy? Is he a chief? I think he is real. Oh, 13 HP, I mean, just about uh, survived that. Anyway. Go hand this quest in at uh, 250 XP, OP. Got snatched a flame. I remember actually making a video of this on my uh, Hunter. I remember actually doing it. It was the first videos I'd done of WoW. Or I remember playing WoW last year. I did a couple of videos, real newbie videos. But I did a, a Hunter for a couple of videos, and that was mission. It took me about 10 minutes to work out what was going on. I just didn't know where to click, and now I know. It obviously makes life a lot easier for myself. Just happy days. Um, it'd be nice when I get that bonus XP as well. 20% XP, I might be able to buy another one as well, I'm sure. I have to have a look and see what the vendors are selling. I'm pretty sure you can buy with some of honor points and stuff. There's nothing really else that I'm going to spend the money on, so I may as well use it on this stuff. I guess. Um, so yeah. Pretty basic at the moment, you know, nothing too fancy happens at this level, you know, we want to get to level 15, that's where we start doing dungeons, but even then it's pretty hard to get into dungeons because there's not many people with low level accounts, so come like level sort of 75, uh, well, like my warlock is 77 or whatever, whatever it is, it's quite easy to find dungeons, there's a lot of people around that sort of level. I find it really long to find dungeons, or at level sort of like 87 to 89 dungeons are really hard to find. I haven't really done too many at level 90. I've kind of since I got to level 90, I kind of went off well a little bit. Really, a few I achieved. Obviously, there's a lot still to do, but I achieved really what I wanted to do on it. Um, and then still loving league. You know, getting back into league. Well, was quite a nice break from league, but then I realised, you know, what league kind of gives compared to well for me. My for me anyway. You know, I enjoyed well. It's very kind of chilled out like this. It's just cool. You know, I'm just relaxing. Whilst league, you know, you I can't just chill like I am right now. I just feel relaxed. You know, you got to be on top of your game all the time on league, and uh, you get wound up a lot more on that because of trolls. Whilst on this, you don't really have that as much. Because you're generally on your own unless you have a buddy or do a dungeon. Hey, <laughs> you're on. Um, I was getting half ten. I've just been out for a meal with my. Uh, Family, I'm trying to pitch too much beer. My um, stepdad, or oh, not my stepdad, my mum's partner, his brother's down in there uh, from Canada. We've been drinking some beers. I think it's gone to my head a bit. Not in a necessary way, I feel drunk, but it's made me feel a bit sleepy. It's weird. Anyway, it's not important. I'm gonna get these items. There's not really a mailbox around here, so. I just have to cut. I don't think that it is. I've just kind of got to do these first sort of levels. Just got to grip my teeth through them. Um, I didn't actually get the trinks or whatever they're called on my warlock toys like level 40 with him. So the fact that I'm going to be able to get them at like say level 7 or something, I guess, is pretty nice. Um, that's cool. Oh, he's got a load of quests for us, which looks nice. One nice thing is the fact I know what these quests, quests are, so I'm able to do them pretty easily. I think I anything. Oh, actually, I don't think I have any place to use. Da da da. Rubbish. So, let's see if we can sell these to him just to free up some space. Are you going to sell any dime today? I don't know if they're going to sell their black. So, I guess they have been sold, but it just hasn't recognised that yet, maybe. Alright, I think I'm pretty sure it did sell. Well, one did anyway. The other didn't seem to want to. Um, anyway, we go over here, we basically got to fight some of these geezers. 
if we go over here, this is where the driver is, so we just kill like one or two around here. It kind of makes this process a little bit easier. We got Kapow, Kapow. I can't wait to actually be able to start to use this one as Chi. Don't like my Chi just sat there. Anyway, alright, cool. We've uh, basically rescued him, but we still have to kill a lot of these, so. I don't know if he can help us, or is he just a pussy, or... I think he's a pussy. Even that's it's cool. Just got to kill on four of them. I hope, well, that's if they all drop it. I'm pretty sure they normally do. This low level style of things isn't going to be, like, extremely challenging. Like, if I was trying to hunt for this at, like, level 90, I'd probably have to kill, like, 50 flipping AI to actually get the, uh, pieces I need. Whilst this, everyone seems to be dropping them, which is pretty cool, but... If they made it too hard for low level, I think it would put people off, or... Especially, like, new sort of people that have only just started playing the game and stuff. The MMOs is, like, for me, when I first kind of started getting into WoWs this year, like, two months ago, or... I think it was about two months ago now, like, really I didn't have a clue what I was doing. It's, it's pretty hard. There's a lot going on to understand you know, your professions and everything. Um, and armor and what armor you need and so forth. But once you get your head around it, it's good fun. And I say, if any of you guys who are newcomers uh, want any tips or you, you want to know how I do something on the game, just let me post a comment in the section below and I'll get back to you when I see the comment and see what we can do. But hopefully in this video I'll cover some, or during these videos I'll cover some interesting stuff that's quite useful and I'll be able to own some bitches. Anyway, I've got my new um, moves that's actually used Chi now. Attack with the palm of your hand, dealing 13 to 24 magic damage. Also, grants you tiger power, causing your attacks to ignore 30% of the enemies. Armor for 20 seconds, that's pretty nice. Bit of armor pen. Or well, not necessarily armor pen, we just ignore the armor, but around the same sort of lines anyway. That's cool. Um, but like I say, because I've got my um, warlock, I'm going to be able to get like all my 16 slot bags on here and hopefully 20 soon. Depends what I do on my warlock. My tailor is pretty high. Um, but I will get new professions on this store. And I will show you how you can get like 16 slot bags anyway. And you just have to get your rep up with places. But it just takes a while to get a full 16 slot bags. This way having the ones I've already got because I've got so many. It just, you know, just makes life a lot easier for me. But that's the bonus, like I say, of having a high level account. But if you're new to this game, you won't kind of have that. But because I've got like a level 90 and level 78 or whatever, it makes my life a lot easier, really. Um, just the fact I can kind of use it to its full advantage to do stuff like this and obviously get this like additional 10% XP. I've got two. I might be able to buy some more if I can. That would be kind of really nice because it just means that you get more XP really. It gives you the best stats for those levels as well up to level 85, which is nice. So it all mounts up. Yeah, see the stalls are someone there, I thought we killed them. Look at him trying to be a boss, little bitch. Boom, that moves pretty nice. Got some nice damage. Oh, 30 to 24 at the moment, but it's better than that. We can spam it as well as long as we've got some chi. Pretty sure when I do this one move as well, it actually generates two chi. Generating two chi, so basically you want to spam this twice. I'm starting to get my head around it a little bit more. This is just obviously my knowledge as well. Like before, I never really understood this when I was playing the. The monk, but now I can understand what I'm actually doing. It makes my life a lot easier. The fact that I just kind of spam this at the moment twice, and then you go beam to that, and you know, just regenerate your chi, which is really cool. Basically, you don't really lose any energy that way. But obviously, I've only got two moves, so it's nothing really fancy. But that's cool. Anyway, I say so. Which is done. Ooh, the main one. So, like, instead of having a six slot, we have a ten space on top of it, which is pretty quite a big difference. And that sort of certainly helps in the, uh, the long run, anyway. Collect more items, make more money, and so forth, so forth. Anyway, we've got to make our way up here and see what uh, this guy wants. Well, it's level four, which is pretty cool. Kind of levels to a reasonable extent. Nothing super OP, but doing what needs to be done. Um, so yeah, 
That's cool. Let's see what this guy has got to say for himself. I mean, we'll kill these monkeys now. Take that, monkey brother. That's not the best thing to say to the old monkeys. Anyway, here they are. We've got a couple over here. we we'll just try and kill them as quick as possible. And everyone's happy. I, but the thing what I do really love about the uh, Pandarian starting area is just the music. I really like the sort of Chinese music they have too. It's pretty nice. Um, but yeah, that's about it really. It's really nice this 1 2 combo, just the fact that how I can spam those moves now. It's quite nice. But I don't think I get to choose what spec I am until level 10, so. We just kind of follow the normal sort of tree. That'd be nice once we hit level 10 because we start to, be able to get some heals and stuff. Even though we won't have a massive amount of damage, hopefully, with a sustain for our heals, that will be able to mean we can quest easy enough anyway. And once we get level 30, we can uh, draw specs, so. That's cool. I do, like I said, I don't think I'm getting tank, I just go healer and damage. I, the thing what really I like about the monks is that spinning kick move, that's what I really want to get. I don't know what level you actually get at, but that, that move just looks absolutely done. Just the fact that you just get around spinning, that's just it's really cool. Slicing these old monkeys up. That's ah, two more to go. Where are you at then? There's one running over there. Where are you running, bitch? You best be coming back here. How if I was actually uh, facing the right way then, I think. There we go. That just leaves. One more over there. Oh, that five copper making me a rich man. Oh, there's one over here actually. Destroy this little bitch. Where do you think you're going, boy? There we go, we leveled. We don't actually get any from for it, but we leveled, which is nice. Shows that we're moving forward to a reasonable extent. Let's see what this guy. Where is he? There he is. See what he's got to say for himself. Blah blah blah. Give me your leg. Yeah. Oh, we got another monkey attacking us. Attacking motherfucker. I'm taking your quest. Get him for me. Get a pussy about. Ah, so we gotta go collect some wood. And summon the uh, flammable. It's pretty simple to be honest. The annoying thing is just all the monkeys that are running around. Cause sometimes you pull a couple and it's not really what you want to pull if you can avoid seeing them now. It's happier days, but that's easier said than done. Unless I have to kill no no no. There it is. I thought we had to collect it. Like I say. Easier said than done as we already found one monkey so far. But He's one dead monkey, he gives me two copper, you know, definitely worth it in his body. So here's three, oh, there's two of them over here, actually, I thought there was three. I need to get ten on auto, but I really fill my bags off at the moment. Once I get my 16 slot bags, they say I make my life a lot easier. I have so much cloth uh, on my um, tape. Warlock is crazy. What we need to do is summon this dude. I think we got to kill him if I remember correctly. Someone's like some water spirit or something. Yeah, living there. Close enough. We just spam our two because of our chi and then we just press one and we regen that back. You know. Quite nice. We get our flat and bleeds. That's that part down. Try and avoid that monkey. You know, picks it up. Stuff I want. For the noob, this guy. Alright, there seems to be there's one e one over here. There's a monkey that will spot me. There's not really much I can do about that. Anyway. At least now we have our uh, picked up that thing anyway without interrupting us. Just need one more. God who we are tired now. Yeah, we're getting old, we're getting tired by half ten. It's never good. It's half ten PM as well, by the way. I'm not getting tired by half ten. 
Ten thirty in the morning, I believe you are. There's one over there actually, I might just run to that one as there's a monkey behind me which I just CBA to fight. I'm gonna get this bad boy. Nice. Uh, get that bad boy on. Nice, nice, nice. Really nice. Just a little rat chasing us. Oh, monkey, are oh, two of them chasing us now. Leave me alone. I don't want to fight you. Go away. Is this dude going to help me? You know? Just going to watch me die. Spam on my cheek because we just do that. Uh, oh, we fought a no one. God, you got to be kidding me, man. Just go away. Flipping goddamn ugly ass monkeys. There we go. Damn ass motherfucker. Alright, we can complete those. That puts us in a good position to, uh. Just in a good position, I guess. We're almost close to getting hit level 5. Um, we have to go speak to some dude. We'll pull these monkeys on the way, but I uh, fuck it, I'm just gonna run past them. What we have to do, I believe, is go to the top of a mountain. Or well, not a mountain, we just get inside this cave. Then we have to go up to the top over there. So I, I might just do up to about here and then I'm going to call it quits for this episode, guys. Um, and then I can send over my tape of stuff from my warlock and go to bed as well. And I'll work on some more episodes tomorrow, even though it doesn't really make a difference. Because by, this, by the time this is actually uploaded, there'll probably be a next episode instantly anyway. Um, it's probably going to take me a day or two to get around to uploading it. So I need to render it out and so forth. And any other videos? I've got two wow druid videos. What I've been sitting on my channel for like a week, which I just haven't kind of published published yet. So I need to get them out of the way, and then I can see where my channel is and start moving forward with it. Um, getting a bit carried away from myself. I need to light these fires first. Oh, do something to them. Yeah, we do have to light them. It's just kind of confusing because that one was already lit. Um, anyway. One more to go after this bad boy. There we go. And then we have to fight this dude. Sometimes if you're lucky, someone else is in this room and they help you fight him. Otherwise it's pretty long to actually kill him. A bit annoying. I'm pretty sure we fight him. There we go. No. So no, let's see. The thing is, look at his HP to mine. Like, 1,204. Like, what the fuck is that about? What am I going to do against him? Slowly but surely here. <laughs> this dude doesn't seem to be doing any damage to me. Which is nice. And this cheese is pretty nice because I can just go boom like that and then go just auto attack him with my what or hit him with my one and then I'm just get a nut. <laughs> Two load of cheese for instant beam. Boom. Have I actually got to knock all that HP off in the car? Oh uh, yes I do. That's gonna be long, that's what I mean it's nice when sometimes you know you just have the random person here. Who's doing the same thing as you, and they just, you know, you just get it down in no time, really. Why well, running around? It's just a long process. Just keep spamming my chi just so that when I go one like that, it basically makes me full chi, and then by the time I spam this chi, um, I have my uh, things recharged anyway. Give me this dude for me to sleep. <laughs> Level 90. I'm <laughs> pretty sure that's what he is, an elite or whatever it is. He's too high level, won't tell me his name, so I'm feeling he could be level 90. Just does no damage to me, but then really saying that I do no damage to him. <laughs> just making him something like this, just making me sleep. I can deal with the other missions because they're kind of quick pace, but this is just like I'm just standing here, or sat here, just smashing my. Numbers on my keyboard. Falling in almost half tempted, half drifting away, and this dude has another 4000 HP. Like, what the fuck? It's long, that's like I say, why it's really nice if there's just a random person here. It just makes you kill them so much, uh, it makes me kill, it makes you kill them so much quicker, which is all about, really. I can't believe how tired I am at the moment. Are you on a no call? Anyway, 
There we go. I blink for a second, he's dead. Hey, I'm gonna go speak to the stop war, dude. Oh, he used to. Maybe I'm missing something. Maybe I, I haven't spoke to him yet. I've gone up the wrong way. I think that's why. I don't know what was up that way. I don't think that was the way. I want to. I want to go this way. Do you? Could be wrong. I've been. Yeah. There we go. There he is. We can speak to that dude. We have iron with Broly Poly now, which is pretty cool. Um, I need to. Like sort out my action bars in a second. Actually, I'll show you what. Well. I'll wait to the next episode and you can see how I do my um how I do my uh moves, how I organise them. I only have three at the moment so it's not really that important. Is this guy gonna get summoned? There we go. That base he just follows me and it's all happy days. Got my Roly Poly which is pretty nice as well now, which should help me get around a bit quicker. Oh, I think I forgot to actually speak to this dude. I kind of rushed off a bit too soon. I don't know if I can get back up this way now. I feel like an absolute tit. I don't know what I did wrong. I think I didn't speak to that guy a second time, but... Um, I'm pretty sure that he just follows me. Well, yeah, I know he does follow me. That's guaranteed. I just don't know why he didn't, I guess. I'm pretty sure I spoke to him when he had his question mark. But I don't know why he had no one. Missing something, I guess. He's. I don't know. Anyway. I could take him out of here. There he is. Follow me now. That's always one good thing. I'll go return him and then, uh. Because I don't want to quit and then he's just going to disappear. I've got to go all the way back there. I don't know how long I've been recording this episode for, but it's putting me to sleep. Not so well, I just think. I'm just tired in general. Beers have gone to my head. Anyway, fight the monkeys. Just carry on running. Need to run to this. Oh, yeah. Okay, so, uh, we need to run over here, up here. And the monkey, yeah, but the monkey should stop chasing us by now. I'd be pretty amazed if he was. I'm pretty sure he's not because I can't hear him anymore. I could hear him a second ago. Anyway. We'll make our ways up here and then I'll call it quilts. Get some beauty sleepers that you need that shit. Um Come on dude, we can make it. We can do it. Almost there. This is where I find out I'll go to. Ooh, me, I'm tired. Um, that's where I find out I've gone to the wrong uh, place. I'd say. Anyway, that's cool. And we'll do a little roly poly until war, just so that's how we roll. Make our way down here. And that's it, pretty much, for this episode, guys. Um, so, yeah, hopefully you're enjoying. Obviously, nothing really special happens at level 5. Like once we get level 15 and start doing some dungeon, we'll have a couple more moves. Level 30, I always think when it starts to get interesting, but I'll try to make as many videos as I can on my monk like this. Just let me know you, what you want to see, guys. If you uh, want to see me do something in this video, like uh, so how do you do lay out your moves or something like that, just let me know in the comments and I'll try and sort someone out. Or if you want to see some more Warlock or gameplay and, or even League, there's still going to be plenty of League coming, so don't worry about that. Definitely you guys who are watching this and are still enjoying my League videos, there's still going to be plenty of that. I haven't stopped playing League. There may not be as many GTA videos up now, but we'll wait and, we'll wait and see what happens. So. See what the fans want, what you guys need, and take life from there. But anyway, I'm going to have to show off. Quarter to 11, I'm flipping forward and sleeping. I used to be up to like 8 in the morning back in the day, but there we go. So, nevertheless, hope you guys enjoyed this so far, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Peace.